Welcome everyone watching on YouTube, because I know probably no one's going to watch this on Twitch, but this is for everyone on YouTube, this is for y'all. I finally picked this game up today, been wanting this for a long time, and it's time to play some. So, I'll do a quick little stream of this today for part one been so long since I played this I don't even uh, I don't really remember much from it but <clears throat> man I can't believe how good it looks it looks amazing this dude drunk as skunk I need to turn up the volume a bit of this on my headphones. So sorry. Okay, now I can't get my... Oh, I hate Xbox for this. I'm trying to get my Twitch broadcast back up now. Sometimes. I'm Jake. Your friends from Blackwater hired me to guide you. They ain't my friends. Boz, how do I get this back up now? Hey, Jake. I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. All right, sorry about that, guys. Just giving her, giving her on the piano. I have never beaten this game. A little something for everyone. I have owned this game probably a handful of times and have never beaten it. So this is something I really want to play through and beat. Um, and I am going to try and live stream, live stream it a lot. Okay, how does one go faster? There we go, there we go. If I remember correctly, the horse is... Whoa! Alright, just trying to get these buttons back here. It's a right bumper stops you. Pretty sure these horses have cruise control somehow. Yeah, if you just hold it down one speed I think. had to go up north to fight Indians, or maybe they got tired of being soldiers and went looking for gold. You know how things is. So what are you doing up at the fort? I'm looking for an old friend. Well, like I says, you ain't gonna find many folk around those parts these days. Those you do fight are about as sociable as an old three So I am pretty happy with the gameplay in this, actually. Um, I, I didn't record the... the company opening intro to the game because the frame rates were dropping so bad on it. I was actually wondering if I was going to have to take this game back because something's wrong with it. But yeah, the opening intro, <clears throat> the opening intro, the frame rates were absolutely terrible. It was skipping and lagging so bad. But now that I've gotten into the game, it's actually running really smooth. Well, if you're fixing for some female company, you can do a lot worse than Armadillo. 
fine as cream gravy they are. Not like Steve's landed. Dang, those also, I apologize about not having my connect set up. So you guys can see me. That will be something I'm bringing back up pretty soon. So in the streams to come, you guys will see. I'll have the uh, the video set up again. Yeah. So it was the marshal who hired me, Lee Johnson. Do you know him? I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from some Blackwater big bugs asking for a guy. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. It's kind of like me on stream, not very talkative. I don't mean nothing by it. Trust me, there's things you better off not knowing. I'll tell you, Mr. Marston, those coyotes eat better than I do. <laughs> not Ooh. far now, Mr. Marston. The fort's just over this hill. Oh, shit. That's not what I wanted to do. Go. Come on, horse. God damn it. There we go. Whoa, yeah, there's really not much of this never, game that I remember. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rolled in and took the place over. So I understand. Audio is a bit choppy this in this game. Part ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. <laughs> I didn't find that very funny. <clears throat> I'm gonna just mosey on up here, I guess. What if I should get off my horse? Alright, fuck it. Oh, he gets off anyways. Hello? Bill! Bill, I've come for you! <laughs> oh shit. Them's fighting Bill words. Williamson. Come out here right now! Go away now, John. Don't <laughs> make me kill you. Nobody needs to kill anyone, Bill. You must think I was born yesterday. You always did think I was an idiot. <laughs> that ain't fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh. oh, what? Oh shit. Look like I need saving. Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. Well, you never tried to save me before. You only seemed to save yourself. It sounds like I've heard this guy's voice before, like. Bill, I implore you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> You implore me. I don't know about anyone watching this, but I'm getting an echo from my audio. I think I got my sound bar too high. Turn it down. Well, things are different. That's a little better. Now I'm in charge. No more Dutch. And no more you. We'll see about that. I, I implore you. To go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. <laughs> well. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> oh game's over. Forget. <laughs> hmm. I can't believe that I don't remember any of this, really. I, I think I've played more of the Undead 
nightmare that I've played of this one. And this has the undead nightmare on here as well, so <clears throat> when we beat this game, we'll move on to that one. I can't figure that. If you guys hear noise in the background, Mason is trying to figure out Lego Batman, and I am not good at those games. So I don't know what you got to do with that part, buddy. I'm sorry. New friend, old problems. Oh, I think. Okay. Yeah, this is. I think I remember this part. Yeah, I remember her. She's snooty. So it would seem. So how do you feel? I got shot. What do you think? I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was. Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us fifteen dollars. I'm sorry, madam. Should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To die, Mr. Er, Mr. Uh, Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarlane. Miss Bonnie McFarlane. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarlane. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? Trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance for old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Hold on to the audio, guys. What I got like? some company walking in here. Dumb. Just like you. Thank you, miss. <laughs> you see my hat? I have. And uh, what will you do now? Now I'm gonna. Take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic, just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. And thank you. Doctor's bills? For saving my life, I mean. Rapping looks like it's gonna Mr. get infected. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. I'll bear that in mind. Back in the land of the living, I see. Figured it's about time I started paying back that $15. I sure can use an extra pair of hands around here. Let's see if we can get you back in the saddle. There's the foreman's office. It's also where we lock up good-for-nothing outlaws, such as yourself. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. I picked out a fine horse for you. Gee up! Let's make a tour of the ranch so you can get your bearings. seen a ranch. I 
she's an opinionated one. That's the train station. Things sure have changed since the line finally got finished, bringing in all sorts of new folk like yourself. Is that such a bad thing? Change is only good when it makes things better. Yeah, that's a barn. And here we are, back in the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. Hello there. <laughs> Come on, this is the only chance you're gonna get to rest. Rest, I just woke up. Thank you, ma'am. Getting shot, then riding a horse seems to take it out of you. <laughs> I could use a rest. Sure. Come on. And a in. beer. I'll show you the house, and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Mr. Marston. Miss McFarland. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just a yeah. on our land. This is a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. <laughs> you should see it in Undead. Ready, Mr. Marston? Let's mount up and patrol the ranch. Mount your horse. Uh Oh, I have a day. <laughs> Anyways, I'm not getting into that one. Right, follow me. Keep your eyes peeled for anything suspicious. Company Barney. Thank you, Mr. Marston. I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with I could just shoot coyotes in this. Horse. Whoa! That's not what I wanted to do. Oh shoot! I need to. God damn it! Let's see that rifle. I want a couple of these for the pot. Bet you thought I couldn't use it, didn't you? Easy. All right, that was a chore. Oh yeah. Got one. I shot like five already. Oh, I had that one pinned. Looks like we'll be having rabbit stew tomorrow. Are you telling me I gotta get back on that damn horse again? All right. So yeah, taking me a little bit to get used to these controls again. <laughs> On the horse. Get on the horse. That's not my horse. I don't want that horse. Okay, I guess it doesn't matter what horse I'm on. Let's get going. We've still got plenty of ground to cover. <laughs> Come on, boy. If it's not the rustler stealing our cattle, it's the rabbit stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city. Become a lady of leisure. Was that a coyote? Get those pets before they scare the livestock. Whoa. Yes, you got one. Go. Yeah. Let's go. 
shooting is hard. I would hope. Maybe Bill Williamson did get lucky after all. I didn't really come into it, miss. You're a useful man to have around the ranch, that's for sure. But don't think I've forgotten what brought you here. We'll do whatever we can to help you. I sure appreciate that, Miss McFarland. Here we are. Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarlane. Please be aware of the social disease carried by a certain young lady. All right, guys, that's part one to Red Dead Redemption. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for part two.